Hi, Tyson Mutrix here again with the Mutrix Law Firm, and today I'm answering the question of what are my thoughts on ambulance chasers? Now, I guess to give my thoughts on that, I first need to give you my definition of an ambulance chaser. Uh, I mean, ambulance chaser does not technically chase ambulances, obviously, um, but to me, there's someone that will actually take a case knowing that that will hurt the client's uh, chances of recovery. For example, let's say the case is only worth a couple thousand dollars. The person on their own is probably going to be able to get that amount on their own. So there's no point in taking an attorney because the attorney is going to take one third of the fee. So that's an example of what I would call an ambulance chaser. And really, it's anyone that's going to take a case and it's going to decrease the value or decrease the amount of money that's going to go into the client's pocket. So if you're a, uh, an attorney that's going to do that, I consider you an ambulance chaser. And I think you're bad for the profession. That's my opinion on uh, ambulance chasers. For any other questions about things like that or any other case, things about your case, go to mutrixlaw.com.